Hi everybody. So today I'm going to do a review of the Net Bible. So this one is going to be the large print thin line in the black leather soft. It is by Thomas Nelson. And then there is the New English Translation logo, which I like. I really like the packaging on this one. It's kind of got a, just a satin finish with just the black and white, but it looks really nice and it's just really classy and clean looking packaging. So I really like the way they did that. I'm going to hold that right there so you can read this top section. Now this one is going to have a condensed set of the notes, but if you want to check out the full 60,000 translator notes, check out netbible.org. All right, so here are our features, which we're going to have a line match text, which for a Bible in this price range is just super, super impressive. And when we get to the price, you're going to be impressed. We're going to have a 10 and a half point font. This one is in the comfort print, which is unique to the net translation. So each one of their comfort prints is unique to each translation. So the New King James has its own, the King James and so forth. So I really like the way that they did that. I think it's really unique. We're going to have the condensed set of the notes, full color maps, gives us a nice example of the font. We've got some quotes here from Chuck Swindoll. Joel B. Green and Beth Moore. And look at that. Retail is $39.99, which is crazy for a Bible of this quality. This Bible, I've had it for, boy, probably two weeks or so, maybe. I already bumped Bibles off of the nightstand for this one. So that's impressive. That's how much I like this one. This one here measures out at nine and five eighths inches tall, six and a half inches wide, and it is just one inch thick. So really nice and thin, has a nice grip to it. Perfect to take with you everywhere. You don't feel like you're gonna drop it at all. And this black leather soft, look at the grain pattern that they've got on there that makes it look like leather. And then this right here, that is super impressive. Double stitch line all the way around the perimeter. I mean, that just looks so good. Nobody is talking about that for some reason. I'm not sure why, but as soon as I opened it up and saw that, I was so impressed. Then we've got our little logo right here stamped in there. But just the quality of this black leather soft and the feel of it, and to have it be $40, sewn binding, line match text, you just cannot beat that. So just absolutely impressive. So on our spine, we've got Holy Bible, Net, and Thomas Nelson. So we've got black head and tail bands, two ribbons, nicely done gold gilding. You can see right there, you can actually see the steps on the signatures, if you, as long as you know what you're looking for there. But really nicely done. I think I'm going to add some red under gold on this one. We've got our two ribbons, which we'll see on the inside, but just a beautifully done Bible. I cannot believe that you can get one of these retail for $40, which means you can get it for less online. And I will put a link in the description box. So we're gonna have like a charcoal gray colored paper paste down liner. Our presentation page, we've got our title page. This one is printed in China. We'll have our contents our list of abbreviations. We've got a to the readers. So basically our preface. Now on this one here, if I can find a good spot to hang on to it. So this one here is going to talk about, so in 2019, there was a major update which reached its final stages. The NET's unique translation process has yielded a beautiful, faithful English Bible for the worldwide church today. So I really like the way they did that. And on here, there is all right, so right here. So if you wanted to see the full preface, you can get it right there at netbible.com. So if you wanna take a screenshot of that and read the actual full preface on there. But once you start reading this Bible, I mean, you lose track of time and you just don't wanna put it down. It is that nice. I've already got, a, I think I ordered four, four or five of these in different color cover options to give out for Christmas time. So that is how nice this Bible is. We've got our list of the translators. So plenty of people worked on this one. Great translation team. Then we get into the Old Testament. 
and then right into our text. One nice thing is it is far enough away from the gutter that you don't have to worry about the text falling into the gutter, which that I really like. We've got our double column format. Again, we've got on this one here a 10 and a half point font and it is line matched. I mean, I've got premium Bibles that were over $200 that are not line matched. So for Thomas Nelson to be able to do this quality of a Bible, have it line matched and have it be this nice and sell it for $40 is phenomenal. I mean, they are just knocking it out of the park with their new additions. They're giving all the other publishers a run for their money, that is for sure. All right, so as far as the notes that this one is going to have, they're going to be positioned on the bottom outside of the pages. So all of our subheadings will be in bold, but just such a nice readable font. And no matter where you put it, it lays flat with that nice own binding. Give you a shot of the poetry sections. So we're in the Psalms here. So real quickly, we'll look at the first ribbon, which is a double satin black. Has a really nice feel to it. It is cut nicely. And one thing that I love is it's long enough to use. There's nothing worse than getting a ribbon and having it as soon as you get to this point be too short to hang on to. So I really like that Thomas Nelson is doing nicer ribbons. They're doing different colors and giving more of them because a lot of times in some Bibles, you're lucky to have one. So this is a nice one inch Bible and it has two. So that is really nice. So here is a shot of the Psalms. So really nice and clear. You can see that when you're looking at the text there, you don't have any distractions. The only times that you're going to see anything is in the white space here where there's no text behind it. But if you just look at just the text and read that, you're not going to have any issues at all. We'll get back here to the New Testament. So we're going to see that as we flip through here, that it is just black letter. So we're not going to have any red letter. And I should have marked in here because in this one here in the Net Bible, when you see the Old Testament in bold italics, that is a direct quote of the Old Testament when they're talking about it in the New. And then they also have just plain italic text that is not bold when they're alluding to it. So real quickly, that is a good spot right there. You can see right there in the gutter of the stitching. So a nice sewn binding. And I had this marked with the section when they allude to the Old Testament, but then reading last night, I pulled it out of there. So right here we can see in that text, he will reward each person according to what he has done. And then if we look down at the bottom, it's going to tell us that is an allusion to those other verses right there. So when it's just in italics and it is not bold, that is when they're alluding to the Old Testament, whereas the bold italics will be a direct quote. So there is another example right there of the direct quote. And then there are some of the notes. So again, the notes are going to be on the bottom outsides of the pages. So we've got our second ribbon. This one is a nice shade of red. So again, really nice double satin. They're wider ribbons. I believe they're like a three eighths, I believe, but don't hold me to that because I don't really recall. Then once we get to the back of the Bible, once we get to the end of Revelation, We're going to have a one year reading plan. So it's gonna give you both a morning and evening reading. So we can see there in the morning, we've got New Testament in the evening, we've got Old Testament. So nice that it does have a reading plan. And then we're going to have four pages, eight if you count front and back, of blank pages that you can take notes on. You could, since they're not lined, you could always put a piece of lined paper behind that. And then that's gonna help keep your notes nice and straight because you can kind of see right there that you would be able to see through that to keep your notes nice and tidy. 
Then we're going to have our full color maps. You see right there that it is on a glossy paper, kind of thicker, but not a like a full card stock. So we will have seven maps spread out on eight pages. So we've got right here in the gutter, some more stitching. So really nice sewn binding. And one thing that you can see right there, we're in the back in the maps and it is laying totally flat. So for a Bible that is just one inch thick, that is super impressive on this binding. And again, retail of $40 is just insane for this nice of a Bible. So we've got our two page spread there. So these are gonna be the Zondervan maps. Nice colors, you can see everything. You can read the print really nicely. And then we get right to the end of the Bible. But I can, if you could feel this like through the camera, I would love for you to be able to feel this because you would bet that this Bible costs twice as much as it does. So you got that nice grain look on there. So a leather soft is awesome for people that are vegans and don't want leather. So again, we've got that double stitch line, the logo there, just really nicely done, perfect size. The translation is excellent when you're reading from this one. I mean, you just, you won't want to put it down. I started reading the Gospel of John out loud to my husband and dog the other day, and we both just lost track of time and I just kept reading. So it just has a really nice flow to it. So again, this one is the Net Bible, large print thin line. There again is the ISBN number. Retail is $39.99. You can definitely find it for less online. I will put a link in the description box. And then I will also be doing a review of the full notes edition. So this one is the full notes. So you can see the thickness difference there. But again, if you went with just this one, you can get the full set of notes online. So I'm just gonna give you just a quick shot of the layout on this one, so just so you can see the scope of the notes that are in this, because it is impressive. And definitely just check out the website and go and check it out and read some of the notes. So right here up top, kind of in this box section, you can kind of see that outline there with the white. So we've got two scripture verses here, and then these three columns are all notes. And the nice thing about this one you're going to have translator notes that are in here. It's going to be marked to let you know. There's going to be study notes, which will offer both historical and cultural context. And then there's also going to be text critical notes in here. And on those, they'll highlight alternative readings in like the Hebrew, Aramaic, and the Greek manuscripts. So if you were ever wondering why they translated something the way that they did, the Net Bible with all these notes is going to explain that to you. So watch for the full review of this one as well but definitely get yourself one of these because this is an amazing bible i would also like to thank thomas nelson for sending out this copy for review all right thanks for watching have a great day